pause for a product malfunction. What's happening, Palooza Party? It's your girl Gigi, and you are watching Anime Palooza. Today I have a brand new unboxing to this channel. This will probably be the only one I'm going to do, but the theme for this box this month was so great and so relevant to you guys that I felt like I needed to show you. So what I have today is the Fortune Cookie Soap Monthly Box. So I've been subscribed to Fortune Cookie Soap for years. <laughs> they used to have a quarterly box where they put out bath products and lotion and they all have pop culture relevant themes for the most part. So in the past they have done themes such as the Lorax for spring, Peter Pan, um, they're coming out with an Avengers box next month, uh, Nightmare Before Christmas, so many cute things and I love their products so much. So they recently switched over from a quarterly box to a monthly box. Last month the theme was Unicornia, so you know I had to get it because it was all full of unicorns and glitter and stuff. And this month, the theme that we have requested for so long has finally come true. This is Sailor Moon themed bath products in this box. Now um, these are not officially licensed. We'll get that out of the way right now. They're Sailor Moon um, related products that I so I can't wait to see in here. I haven't looked at any spoilers. I don't know what's in here. And let me tell you guys, I have been ordering stuff from this company since basically I learned how to use PayPal. <laughs> like I love their products so much. I use their lotion, their whipped cream every day. I don't go anywhere without it. Um, so I'm really hoping that there are products in here that I can love and love them even more because they're Sailor Moon themed. Um, this box I believe is it's kind of expensive. I think it's $32.99 a month. I will put the real price off to the side here. And you can subscribe by going to fortunecookiesoap.com and looking for their monthly box. I will leave my referral link in the down bar. And if you click on that, they have like a reward system so you can earn points for buying products or referring people or whatever. Um, it would help me out if you guys want to subscribe to the next box which I'm not sure what it is because um, Avengers pre-order is over so whatever's after Avengers is the next box um, and they're gonna have a launch for these products coming up hopefully very soon um, so I can't wait <laughs> they're gonna actually sell the products outside of the box and I have like a $65 credit so I'm really excited to open this to see what's inside and this stuff usually smells fantastic like spring and summer are my favorite collections from them because there's none of that weird bakery stuff which I don't like. Anyway, I've talked so much about this company, but I really love them. I've followed them and bought their products for a long time. So I'm excited to share them with you because it's sort of anime themed. So let's get our unboxing on. Okay, so in every box it comes with a little handbook and it tells you the products inside. So um, this is actually going to launch on March 30th at 12 noon central time. And it is a Soap Scouts collection. We didn't choose the Soap Life, the Soap Life chose us as it says on here. And uh, I'm going to read you a little blurb on this because it's really cute. Soap Scouts in the name of FCS. She will never turn her back on a friend. She was always there to defend. She is the one on whom we can depend. We formulate and hand make all our products using top shelf ingredients and botanicals. <laughs> You'll feel and see the difference. I thought that was going to be cuter than it was. Um, so I'm not going to look in this quite yet. I'm just going to start pulling stuff out of the box, which is nicely wrapped in yellow tissue paper. And we're going to see what we get. So the first product is Moon Princess Clarifying Shampoo. And it is pink. And it is lovely. And let's see what it smells like. Which, oh god, it's getting all over. It smells like pepto -Bismo. It does. Pause for a product malfunction. Okay, so it kind of smells like pepto bismol not gonna lie. That's still a thing, like children's Tylenol. It smells like bubblegum, sort of. Moon Princess Clarifying Shampoo. For love and justice, the pretty sailor-suited soldier Sailor Moon. In the name of the moon, I will punish you, untamed hair. Jelly-filled donuts, bubblegum, cotton candy, and lemon drops. Transform your locks into a state of complete serenity with this perfect liquid shampoo. Um, it's just shampoo. Nothing really special about it. However, I do need a new shampoo. I've been using this shampoo from Korea that I really like. 
Um, but this would be nice to travel with if it won't pop out of this bottle. And I'm leaving for Anime Boston in a couple weeks, so we'll see if that makes the cut. Next is Love Me Chin Shimmer Shower Oil. Um, so this is a product I don't really use. Um, they make a lot of shower oils and here it is in the bottle. This is based on Sailor Venus. I can't tell what it smells like. It smells like pineapple. Protected by Venus, the planet of beauty, guardian of love, Sailor Venus. Allow this shower oil to shimmer you with the power of love. Allow the golden orange glow swirl about you with juicy pineapple and peach nectar infused with a blend of fresh mango and lemon curd. A light sesame formula glides easily to glides on easily to moist, moisturize dry skin. It's so sheer it vanishes with only a subtle touch of mica and sinks into shower damp skin, leaving it soft and silky with a healthy radiant glow. So after you get out of the shower, you spray this on and it's supposed to moisturize and give your skin a glow. Um, I'm real sensitive to stuff like this, so I re really don't use it all the time and I, I don't use their shower oil, but this one smells really nice, so I might actually have to. Oh yes, I needed bubble bath so badly. This is Aqua Illusion Liquid Bubble Bath and it is blue and it is kind of pearlescent but there's no glitter in it which is good because i hate products with glitter in it protected by mercury the planet of water guardian of wisdom sealer mercury douse yourself in water and repent in this luxurious bubble bath oh whoops let me smell it first to see if i can see what it smells like <sighs> kind of like blueberries or blue raspberry uh nope definitely not uh the scents of mercurian water orchids sweet blue agave bergamot pear nectar and coconut blossoms will rejuvenate your mind to strategize with the inner sailor senshi um because of the high vitamin c and antioxidant content the passion fruit extract helps keep skin looking firm and youthful acai berry extract is blah 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 you put this in the bubble bath <laughs> you put this in the bath and it makes bubbles um i like this scent not as much as i like the venus scent um but i love their bubble bath so i will definitely be using it and usually they make bubble bars so it's nice to see that it's in a a liquid form Bring the Lightning Bar Soap packed in a little wax paper bag. This is another thing I don't really use from them. I'm not a big fan of bar soaps in general. I normally just use liquid. Oh, this one smells really nice though. It smells like lime and it's got the Sailor Jupiter symbol in there. Oh my god. I want to bathe in this, literally. Agent of love and courage, the pretty soldier, the pretty sailor suited soldier, Sailor Jupiter. I'll make dirt feel so much regret and it'll leave germs numb. Zesty green lime zaps uncleanliness with the force and strength of sugary vanilla and warm amber in rain soaked spring woods. It's soap. <laughs> it's a bar of soap. Oh, it smells so good. I, I'm really, really hoping that usually what they do if they have a full product launch and i think this is their actual spring collection instead of just one of their monthly collections is that they put out a bunch of products in a bunch of different scents so i'm hoping that i can buy the products i actually use in these scents because they smell so good except for sailor moon that smells like pepto bismol oh yes nice oh god i just dropped it okay so this bag is huge it's fire soul crackling bath crystals look at how like it's like an ombre rainbow i love their bath salts their bath salts are also amazing Agent of Love and Fire, the pretty sailor suited soldier Sailor Mars. In the name of Mars, I will chastise you for not relaxing. Oh, I didn't even smell it. Jesus. I'm bad at this. I don't want to open this. God, they vacuum sealed this bag so tightly that I can't even get it open. Through the bag, it kind of smells like bergamot. Huh. Top notes of bergamot, mandarin, and lemon satsuma sprinkled with lime blossoms sears into sore muscles with rays of freshly grated ginger and vanilla bean. As the crackling sounds of popping candy faintly resemble crackling fire admitted from the Kuji a Sailor Mars. Um, so what you do with this is you pour it into your bath uh, when the water is still running and you let them all dissolve. I love bath salts. I use them all the time. They smell really nice. Like, I am so stoked. And then there's one item left in the box. I'm really hoping, it was a jar, I felt it. I'm hoping that it's a whipped cream. 
it's not okay so this is a uh, midnight rose it is a charcoal mask um, I haven't really used their masks before just because I like the sheet masks because they're really easy to take on and take off but let's see what this one says king of earth and protector of skin freshly squeezed lemonade juicy strawberry and raspberry blossoms garnished with ice rose petals soothed with the blackest charcoal of tuxedo la smoking bomber what and it can calm even the most troubled skin types um so basically if you've never used a charcoal mask before it's supposed to stop your breakouts which i need badly right now because my skin is atrocious so you put it on your face um you put it on for five minutes five to ten minutes this one says five and then you wash it off and your skin is supposed to be like rejuvenated and stuff so i have used charcoal masks before um so I will, will use this one and I bet it smells really nice. I like, oh, okay, I guess I'll just open it. I was like, I don't want to take it out of the baggage. And these are all full size products, by the way. Sometimes they throw um, a box full of like half full size and half like deluxe sample size products in there. But these are all full size. Ooh, it's really wet. It has a nice, like, it smells very much like roses. Like, more roses than you think would be in here because rose was, like, the last ingredient. This is a very wet mask. It's not very solid. So be very careful when you're playing with this that you shut the lid tight. And that was everything in the Fortune Cookie Soap Sailor Scouts uh, Monthly Soap Box. Uh... Tell me what you thought about this box or anything that we talked about down in the comments below. Like I said, you cannot buy this box anymore because you have to order them like two months in advance. But their products of this line will launch by themselves on March 30th at noon central time. Their stuff sells out really quickly, so if you want it, you better buy it. Unfortunately, I will be at Anime Boston, so I'm either going to have to go online while I'm there and try to order some stuff or hopefully get some stuff when I get back if there's anything left because if they make any of these scents minus Sailor Moon into whipped cream I need to buy them all because that is my number one product so yeah I I would give this box like a B I love the theme I love the colors of everything I love the smells except for one I just don't care for this bar soap because I don't use it and really I think that they could have had whipped cream instead of this mask i know they're doing an aloe me which is like a whipped cream mixed with aloe in next month which is why they probably didn't put one in this month and i won't use this shower stuff um but you know it is what it is it's a mystery you don't know the products that they're gonna give you ahead of time you only know the theme so i'm not at all sad about this theme except that sailor moon smells like pepto bismo but I, you know, whatever. I will get these scents and other products and it'll be just fine. But let me know your thoughts if you've ever ordered from them before and we'll have our little party down in the comments. If you like what I do and you want to buy me a drink, my Ko-Fi link's in the down bar. If you want to send me something to unbox for this channel, my P.O. box is down there as well. I post videos on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Saturdays. As always, feel free to follow me on Twitter, my anime list, or my figure collection. My username's Anime Palooza at those places. And until next time, love your faces!